show you this basket. Now, this is for local folks here in Ohio. I am um, I'm just right on the, I'm in the middle of three counties actually. But um, I found this, this is an Ohio made basket. Ohio company and I love it. I will never go back to any of the other companies. This can also be used for gardening. It has a one bushel mark inside, 35.24 um, liters mark. So it can be used for gardening. I love that it's got the holes on the bottom. So I can just, the other day when I was doing laundry outside, I just sprayed it down and the water could come out the bottom. You could do that with vegetables. Um, Use your imagination. But see, it's got these little this indention here on the sides. It's for the hip wearing, the hippie, <laughs> hippies, hipster mamas, <laughs> the hipster homemakers. And um, it's just so sturdy. I mean, I trust me, I know about laundry baskets and we have been through some that didn't last long at all. <laughs> and so I bought two of these I want to say they were 14 a piece, I think, 14.50, and I went back and bought three more. And um, I have found them so far at two of my Amish stores, both of those in Holmes County. So if you're ever in Amish country, please, I, you do yourself a favor and get you some of these baskets. They only come in this teal color and brown. I love them. I mean, love them. Now I have told y'all in at least two or three other videos about these baskets, and I have told y'all that they are an America, um, an Ohio, uh, made in Ohio company, an Ohio company, because that's what I was told by the Amish lady that I bought them from, and there's even a sign in front of them that says made in Ohio. So I wanna clarify that with some information that I have recently discovered. I was outside the other day turning this upside down for a little table and lo and behold it said made in India. Wait a minute. This one says made in USA. This one says made in India. Okay, well that's confusing but I do want to give y'all accurate information. So this um, says harvest ready, harvest ready HR100 the bottom line is, I did some research after I read the Made in India. And I'm confused about why we have Made in India, now Made in USA, but it's the same company. And I also want to tell you that I kind of feel silly because this is actually not intended as a laundry basket. I've also found out by doing research, this is actually a harvest basket, a garden product, a piece of, you know, tool to use in the garden. And that's why it's got the holes in the bottom, but I still love it. So if you can, you just harvest ready, HR 100 is what's written on the bottom. I did not find it as an Ohio company, but I found it in Pennsylvania. So just do your own research. I don't ever try to deceive you, but also do your own research with everything. Don't just take everything for face value that you're told because the person might be telling you something, um, giving you, you know, wrong information on purpose, deliberately or not deliberately. So always do your own research. Bottom line is, I still love these as laundry baskets. They are sold in the laundry department or section of two of my favorite Amish um, stores. So I just want to be clear with you on that. I do feel kind of silly that I thought it was a laundry basket, but hey, it's great. I mean, these are the only kind that I love now. <laughs> so I hope these helped you. And if you want to see more information about how to save money, um, check out these videos. One of these two videos I think you're going to like. And I will see you next time. In the meantime, let's all remember to count our blessings.